Katie Bolter was downbeat after losing to Paula Bedosa in the first round of the French Open. Katie Bolter was devastated after losing a late-night thriller against Paula Bedosa at the French Open on Tuesday night. At the end of a rain-hit third day, the British number one and Bedosa only started under the lights on court 9 at 9.11 p.m. local time. From 2-4 to four down in the first set, the Leicester City fan won six consecutive games to claim the first set and go a break up in the second, and then had three break points at 5-5 five to, five to serve for her first ever win here. But former world number two Bedosa fought back to win 4 6 7 5 6 4 when Bolter slapped a forehand into the net on her first match point at 11.29 p.m. I can't speak for the others. I can only speak for myself and I have worked so hard to be in this position and I have just lost out in the finest of margins, a downbeat Bolter reflected afterwards. Ultimately I have done the very best that I can. I will keep doing the very best that I can and put my heart on the line every single match that I play. She added, I am really improving but today was not my day. It was an absolute battle and I gave it everything. The atmosphere was good fun. She just played better than me today. I feel I have got a really good shot of playing well on clay. Bolter joins Andy Murray, Jack Draper, Cam Norrie, Harriet Dart and Dan Evans in crashing out in the opening round in Paris. It is the first time that no British singles players have won a match at the Clay Court Grand Slam since 2020 and the fourth time this century. Playing earlier under the roof on court Suzanne Langland, frustrated Dan Evans admitted, I am fed up with umpires, after going out to Holger Rune. The British number three was fined at the Rome Masters earlier this month for disputing an incorrect line call. And Evans rode with Spanish official John Campistrol in the third set before going out 6 4 6 4 6 4 to the world number 13. After his sixth consecutive tour level defeat, the world number 62 said, I am fed up with the umpires, flat full stop. Remember they do pretty much exactly the same as we do when we all wake up in the morning. They are humans and I think some of them forget that. World number one Novak Djokovic opened his defense of the title with a 6-4-7-6-6-4 win over French wildcard Pierre-Hugues Herbert.